Father Michael Stevens, what do you know about him? I don't. Are you aware that in the mid-1980s he pled guilty to criminal sexual conduct with a minor? I'm not, no. Are you aware that in 2002 he was publicly, in, uh, excuse me, he was uh, removed from ministry? I'm not aware of that. At any time are you aware that the uh, uh, the parishioners of the public were ever informed that um, uh, Father Michael Stevens posed a risk of harm um, to the children in the Archdiocese? That was all before my time. Are you aware that um, Father Michael Stevens is on monitoring? Excuse me? Are you aware that Father Michael Stevens is on monitoring in now? The Palm, in the POMS program, yes. Yeah. And uh, the only ones that know that are now us and um, those in your inner circle, correct? Object to the form. I don't know inner circle. Well, the inner circle would be the chancellors, the auxiliary bishops, and the vicar generals, and your officials. Um, and the monitors. I don't know that for, as a fact. Are you aware that uh, Father Michael Stevens, while on monitoring, still performs IT work for the archdiocese and for various parishes? My understanding is that he had in the past but no longer does perform that service. And he is still a priest, correct? I believe that's correct. And when then did he uh, stop doing the IT work in parishes and for the archdiocese um, while a priest? It was some time ago, but I can't tell you the exact date. What prompted the revocation or termination of his uh, IT work? I don't have that answer. Who does? I would presume um, Father McDonough would know. I think that uh, that happened under his watch. His watch as promoter, but your watch as Archbishop, correct? I don't have those dates. Does it concern you to hear and learn that you had and have a priest by the name of Michael Stevens, who was on the monitoring plan? And by the way, that monitoring plan, did you inherit that from your predecessor, or did you start that? I inherited it from my predecessor. Okay. Does it concern you that you have <coughs> Michael Stevens on such a monitoring plan and that he is still a priest and allowed to go into parishes and do IT work knowing that he had been accused and not under monitoring? That would be a cause for concern. Isn't it a conscious choice being made by Father McDonough to take the risk to let that guy out there uh, uh, as a priest even work in the parishes? Objection. That's argumentative and misstates facts and evidence. I would have to talk to Father McDonough about that. Do you think it deserves some attention? I, I would be willing to talk to Father McDonough about that. Thank you. Now, there is um, um, some indication that um, uh, Deacon Rourke is the monitor of Stevens. Are you aware of that? 
uh, Deacon O'Rourke was the, the uh, Palms person. That's the name I couldn't remember before. Okay. But Mr. John Selvig is now the, the monitor. Is it O'Rourke or Rourke? I've seen um, it both ways. Yeah, I can't tell you. Okay. I've got it as Rourke. I th That's correct. Okay, thank you. <laughs> um, are you aware, Archbishop, uh, that uh, Father McDonough communed, communicated to the monitor, Rourke, concerning Stevens? that um, Stevens was in four to five parishes and the pastors in those doing IT work and a priest, um, the pastors had not been informed of the fact that Stevens had been accused of sexual molestation. On what date are you referring to? I'm just asking if you're aware of that. I was not aware of that. W are you aware that Jennifer Hasselberger, your former Chancellor for Canonical Affairs, raised concerns with <clears throat> uh, Father Laird in 2011 um, uh, about Stephen's status as a priest in the parishes doing this IT work and that he had had a criminal conviction? I was not aware of that. Is it your testimony that Father Laird never discussed that topic with you? To the best of my recollection, he did not. Is it your testimony that Jennifer Hasselberger never brought to your attention concerns uh, that Stevens would not be working in the parishes, uh, being able to do IT work if he had been a layperson because he wouldn't gotten by a record check? I am not aware that Jennifer ever brought that to my attention. 